Wario, that is not how you do jumping jacks. Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. We're going over to the boss which is right up here. This place is sort of expansive yet at the same time it's not. Like, you can climb up on a whole, a whole load of stuff around this area but there really isn't anything for you to find. <laughs> So I just thought, hey, what the heck, I'll show you guys what the heck is up here. I don't think you can get up there, though. Maybe if I climb on top of... Yeah! <laughs> See, you can climb on all sorts of stuff on these overworld places. It's kind of fun to find out what you can climb on. But anyway, I'm wasting a lot of time. Let's just get to the boss. Dino Mighty. Let's see it. Oh, my. I think Rosie O'Donnell has come back. Look at the lipstick, <laughs> lipstick on it. <laughs> and yeah, look out for its shockwave and just punch it until it gets stunned and so that you can pick it up. Watch out for when it does that stomp attack. That stomp thing will hurt you there, needless to say. Just do the stompy thingy and you can grab onto its tail, which will confuse it greatly, but I don't see the point of doing so. It's kind of hard to jump on it. When it does, I mean, when you do that, I'll, I'll show you why in just a second. I, I just want to get one hit off to show you. Ow! <laughs> I did not mean to do that. Somehow I got teleported to the other side or something like that. Okay, pick, pick her up. Yes, he's that strong. And slam her into the ground, and that's how you do damage. And I was going to do some shock waves or just one. Now grab onto the tail. I just want to show this once. You can also throw it into the lava to do damage as well. Like. What do you do from here now? You can climb on the sticky ball, but you can't really do anything to her. And I just noticed it's in a bathing suit. Dear Lord. <laughs> See, it's just wondering, huh? Where? What am I supposed to do here? Maybe I'm supposed to do it like that to stun it? Oh, I guess that does work pretty nicely, actually. Why didn't I think of that before when I was a kid? I always thought you had to do it the other way. Hmm. Just goes to show that you gain... Uh, like a better eye for detail as you get older, so to speak, in, in some cases. And what are you going... Uh, well, that's not always true, of course. I'm just saying, in some cases. <laughs> in that case, that was my example. And, oh, and it apparently can't see me for some reason. I guess it's got very, very bad peripheral vision or something like that. Uh... I wonder if I should attempt to grab it onto its tail, you know, just to do that. Confuse it, attack, so that it raises its tail up. And, oh jeez. More shockwaves, that's not good. More shockwaves, oh dear. <laughs> don't squish me. No squishing. I, I don't want to be squished. Needless to say, this is a pretty easy boss. And, I'm what? Oh, I couldn't grab onto its tail. Oh wait! I almost got a hit, took a hit there just because I said it was an easy boss. Not a very pretty boss, though. Oh, it just stuck out its tongue there. I forgot that I can do that as well. That, that'll needless to say hurt you as well. Oh. Uh, three shockwaves again? Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, jeez! No, don't. No, please don't. I'm begging you. I don't mean to hurt you that much like you planned to hurt me, but s some things just have to be the way they have to be, you know? And Whoa! How did that even happen? <laughs> Oh, I forgot to mention, you can use the L button or the Z button to suck in uh, coins, like when there's a lot of them, like so. So that's a quick way to gather coins. I completely forgot about that when I was doing ye ol control explanation there. Attack, attack! Oh, jeez! Oh, oh, I had its tail! I should have stayed on it, but instead I jumped off out of reaction. <laughs> oh, well. That would have been a guaranteed hit, actually. And what? No, oh, shockwave. Probably three more, right? Three. Yep. Now it, when it gets down to its last two health, apparently it does three shockwaves at once. I don't know how many stomps it does to try and hurt you. Oh, jeez. I did not mean to go under your legs like that. <laughs> oh, and I almost had the tail. I, I, I again jumped off. See what I wanted to do over there was jump onto the tail as, as it was being pulled up because I noticed she was pulling it up and. I, I actually ended up grabbing onto it unexpectedly, and yeah, that's how I jumped off at that time. Uh, oh, and I had the tail again. Dang. 
<laughs> Clearly I am not doing a very good job of it, but at the same time, I still managed to win with Grace. Oh, that is not a good view. Let's just move over here. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot better. One hundred percent in World One. <laughs> I am twisting my handlebar mustache right now. And now, one of those keys goes into the treasure chest, and it'll unlock another world for some reason. I don't know how that works. Maybe it's electronic locks or something like that. This part is going to be ridiculously short. Unless I do another level, so let's do another level. <laughs> I'm just going to hop in here to get transported back to the front area. And four, three, two, here we go. And we got two more levels to 100%. Let's just jump right in. As I said before, the signs all pretty much say the same in terms of their checklist. And why did he say he's number one? He didn't do anything this level. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, this is indeed a spooktastic world. Uh, what if I fall on here? Ah, that's what I thought. It's one of these things. Oh! I found the spring instantly. I wonder if... I still wonder if they hide anything in those areas. By the way, those things really remind me of dry bones. <laughs> what do you have to say? I do, you're not the boss of me, but I suppose I, you know, I do have to to move on, as you said. Those little guys are pretty weak. <laughs> uh, I mean, how do you, am I supposed to like, am I pound it? Ah, okay, you pound it when it hits the ground like that. Ah, okay, oh my god, it uses its, fi <laughs> its fingers as a gun. I completely forgot about this guy. <laughs> and shoot me. Whoa! It actually homes in on you, that's interesting. Three hits, will that do it? Will that do it? Yes! I guess I couldn't leave those little guys behind. Because otherwise they would have gotten in my way, excuse me. Uh, bigger guys, so that means I can do this. Yeah! And somehow I accidentally hit that switch, even though my swing went right under the switch. That doesn't make any sense, but there's a chest right there. Eh, let me... I, I know I can grab... There we go. <laughs> Voila! And what? Ghostly sticky ball. And, aha! I thought so. Is this little ledge here? Gold switch or yellow switch? A trap door. What is this blasphemy? Uh, oh, it's oh, it's a 3D maze like that. Cursed Super Mario RPG maze. You remember that thing that gave me so much trouble? But this one's a whole lot easier. I, I'm just gonna take a guess and say that's all there was in this area because I don't really want to try and explore every little crevice if there is every little crevice. I don't think there is because that's not a very large area of sorts. All right, back. Is there anything over here? I didn't check over here before. No, nothing. Okay. I didn't even know you could go over these fences. You know, uh, typically when you see a fence in a game, it's like it's one of those things that it's an invisible barrier of sorts. So I, I never really think when I see a fence like that on the side, you know, to go over it. It's, it's just force a habit that when, you know, just when you play a lot of games, you notice that sort of thing. But in this game, apparently I should be checking the fences. Now I have to find where the poop is the yellow treasure chest. It's probably somewhere. Oh my! You again! Oh, and you've got sorted buddies this time. I'm not even going to bother with them, I guess. <laughs> oh, gee, I guess I'm going to have to bother with them. Oh my, I must pick up. Oh, no, no. Oh, it's not even aiming for me. That works in my favor, I suppose. Oh, that's pretty easy to knock them out of the sky. If you just jump and press the B, it'll stun them instantly. And I'm playing this boss kind of sloppy. <laughs> ah, come on, punch it. There we go. And shoot over there so I can then throw it at you. That was a terrible shot. <laughs> yeah. One more hit, I'm sure. The bosses seem to take three hits, except for, you know, the main boss of the world. 
I guess I'm gonna have to wait for another bunch of them. Yep. Eh. Eh. And that should be it, I think. Yep. Voila! Will you give me pocket change? A single coin for defeating you. Wow. <laughs> Oh, these platforms right here, you can spin on... Well, you need an enemy to do the spin. To raise them off the ground, I'll need one to get that thing right there. These, these guys are useless to me. Ah, here we go. I will pick up you. I still don't know where that gold treasure chest is. <laughs> Alright, now this is what will happen if you raise this platform. See that? You spin on it, it pops out of the ground, and then you can jump to the uh, heart fragment That's down here. What awaits us? Certainly another puzzle switches. I probably have to hit this one first, just because. Or not. Ah! Uh, I have a feeling I screwed something up. <laughs> Wait, actually, am I supposed to, like, do that? Aha! I don't think that helps me, though. <laughs> or does it? No. Interesting. I, I, or does that switch affect the other one as well? I bet you that's how it works. Like, I bet you I have to do this, jump on there. Ah, there we go. And there's a sprite wing down here for some reason. Ah, uh, I already described that, but thank you for the information. <laughs> Alright, that wasn't too hard. Let's move on. I still have yet to find what the poop that gold switch le led to but wait, wait is that the is that the gold one it has to, i think they, yeah i think that was the gold one yeah, spin 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 there we go just like clear the area and wrong button <laughs> Whoa, delicious yeah that had to have been the yellow switch that was there before and i i, I seen that there was a path through there i don't know if that's if you've seen behind this fence here, like, am I able to go here? No, it's an infamous invisible wall I was talking about before. Curses! The other kind of fence I guess you can't go behind. Alright, so, green switch. And I, don't, I don't know what that did, but we will... Oh, you again? Oh, it's up there. Oh! Okay, slam the ground. Thank you. And now I have to wait. Waiting is not my forte. Slam it. No, no bullets. Slam. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, how am I supposed to get up? I bet you when I get over, I mean, when I find a way to that upper path. Slam. Voila. Open says me. I think, yep. Uh, I think I can spin with you guys. Yep. If an enemy doesn't die in one hit, you can only spin with it. And that other path looks like I'll be going backwards at a certain point. Hello, you guys are new. You aren't very tough, though. <laughs> Some sort of swordfish. Ah, pun. <laughs> wait, wait, I need one of you guys, actually, don't I? They might literally be a... Mario type of swordfish fish because they have that blade on top of their head. And, wow, this is a dark area. Uh, platforming time? Oh, I bet you I have to do one of these things. Yeah, or not! <laughs> oh, I see, it's that block that's moving on the other side. Derp! Uh-oh. Jump rope with spike balls. I have no confidence in this. <laughs> It would be definitely a good idea to turn a camera like this so you can tell where exactly you're jumping. Uh, I have to move over there. I don't know if there's anything inside this chest. I just want to... It just looks important. <laughs> I don't want to miss any heart fragments as well. Just want to take a look around. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay. And the rest should be pretty straightforward, I think. Wah! Voila! Alright, now how the heck do I get to that upper path? Is it this way? Like, am I supposed to go around this tower? Because I know there's some way to get onto an upper path. Because otherwise I wouldn't be able to get that treasure chest off on the other side there. 
I have a feeling you can, can you get higher than this? You can definitely get higher than this. But where? Where is the... How can you get higher than this? Well, I don't know. <laughs> For now, I'm just going to have to... Oh, wait, it's that one, isn't it? Okay, I'm going to have to grab another ghostly sticky ball. And... Hop up here. There we go. Oh my... Ow. <laughs> and jumping on enemies do not, does not kill them. I find that a little bit odd. <laughs> I mean, this is a... Technically a Mario game. Well, I guess it's not. It's a Wario game. Oh, jeez! You again! Uh, did, I, did I hit it? I don't know if it hit it. I think it hit it. I just wanted to try something different there. Because, like, maybe that would do more damage or something. I don't know. Oh! I didn't mean to knock it out of the arena. Oh, it comes back in. <laughs> yeah, I think it does hit it when you throw it at it like that. Oh, come on. I call shenanigans on that. I mean, I was like right in its face, and... <laughs> oh, well. And, yeah, that first time I, I did hit it with this slam attack. The pile driver thing. Alright. So, this path now. This should lead over to that treasure chest, I think. And to a trap door. That's nice. Eh. Oh, I see the treasure chest. It's right there, but I'm gonna go down here first. Mm, what is this? Uh, oh, they they go like that. Well, that's not very friendly. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna have to do like a uh, uphill jumping. There we go. Uh, how does this one react? It's a little bit faster, I see. Okay, so when it goes down and straight, go to it and it start jumping up, 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 and no! I should have stayed on the top block. And then work my way over to the end block again. Alright. Concentrate, PK Gam. I could have probably went on that first turn that, that I had there, but I waited it out. <laughs> Apparently. Alright. Wait for it to go straight. Oh, wait, 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 wait! <laughs> Thought it was gonna go straight, but it didn't. Okay, top block. Now I work my way to the other bottom block. There we go. Turning the camera was definitely beneficial there. Am I missing anything? I don't see anything of significance, so I'm just gonna move on, grab that, and get out of here. Why did he say uh oh? <laughs> Alright, that's collected, and this leads, yeah, back over here. We've completed this! I could have just went down back the other way. <laughs> Although, maybe not, because those bubble, those ghost ball things only come from one side, obviously. Uh, well, hmm, how do I get up there? Oh, there's another door up there, okay. Oh, you are a very good lock. <laughs> I guarantee no, no lock, uh, well, no lock picker will try and pick that lock. <laughs> Unless you're, you're Wario and you're fearless or something like that. Alright, I'm just gonna go inside. They're gonna cream me. <laughs> mm, which one? Which one? Which one? I, I'll try this one. I, I don't know which... Uh, looks like they lead to the same thing, I guess. Uh, how do I get to... Oh, that chain. Okay. Because I, no I noticed... Uh, you can grab onto chains from the second level. Voila! Uh, oops. <laughs> Did not mean to do that. Now, do I want to go this way or the other way? Eh. I, I think I should go the other way because it leads back outside, per se. I think... Because I think this is going to take me to a dead end and not to a new path. What I always like to do is go to the dead ends first, just to like... I mean, you know, clear everything out that I've been to before. Just to make sure that I don't miss anything. Ah, now the tutorial on the L button to suck up coins. And yeah, the Z button works just as well. Alright, to the other door we go! Avoiding the lightning. Well, it's not really lightning so much as it is... Well, it's just electricity. And there's another Spriteling here. Yeah, I've... I'm sure people got the feel of that by now. Hello! Oh my... Wait, you are different than the other one, aren't you? Oh my god! 
<laughs> Jeez! <laughs> I got a little bit reckless there, I admit. But this is, I suppose, a good opportunity to show you the continue. Wow, it only costs 200 coins to continue? That's a pretty cheap continue. <laughs> Especially since you get that much. Like, easily per level. Come on, pop out of the ground. Come on. Please? You know what? Screw you. <laughs> I don't need you. Uh, oh my. Oh! Okay, that wasn't that dangerous at all. Can I break it from the top? Yes, I can. I could use that garlic earlier. Did I miss anything? This is a pretty neat little area here. It's got little paths to an unknown mine blocked off. I just don't want to miss any, like, you know, heart fragments. Okay. Doesn't look like it's anything. Let's go! And continue. Run, 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 run. Wah! Blue switch does something. <laughs> I really hope I didn't miss anything. Oh, no, not another one of these. Run, 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 run. <laughs> Ow! These guys are worse! Okay, if I... Ah! Okay, okay, you can dodge to the sides. It, it's not that wide of a blast, okay? Can I do anything about these crates? These crates feel like I could do something. Nothing, nothing. Ah! Don't hurt me. Um... <laughs> uh... Anything over here? Heart fragment, nice. What is that over there? Am I missing... Oh... Hmm... I... have a feeling that I've missed something, maybe? But I don't, I don't recall seeing any blue pedestals around there. You know, it's for a uh, blue treasure chest. Oh, wait, wait, I see. That, that thing that we've seen back there was actually that room. That, I thought that I actually missed the room somehow, but that is actually... Uh, see, remember that flower? Yeah, that's it right there. So I guess I didn't miss anything. Whoa, my. Oh, it's a battle arena thingy. Most kills in 60 seconds. Let's do it. I've already been doing it, actually. I should probably start combo attacking. Yeah, yeah. Man, I did a poor job at spinning the control stick there. <laughs> on auto spin. Oh. And when you you have to get it to auto spin so that you can move Wario around, basically. And there we go. Something like that. When you get around to the other side, Wario. You're just not you're not doing any damage to him. <laughs> Come on, just die already. Thank you. <laughs> And this guy is super large, but he makes a pretty nice whirly gig of sorts. <laughs> Whoa, you can pick up the... <laughs> I didn't know that. They don't look like a thing that you would be able to pick up. But you apparently can. Alright, what's my prize? Lots of coins, as you would expect, I guess. Alright, so we're looking for a blue treasure chest. Well, at least a blue platform with a treasure chest on it. And oh, there's a trap door of sorts. And what the heck is this place anyway? It's like a factory underneath the mansion of sorts. I hope I didn't stumble into the Rainbow Factory or, or something. Oh, poor Scootaloo. By the way, don't look up that fan fiction if you don't know about it. <laughs> Wait, how do how do I get up there? Well, uh, unless you like grimdark fan fictions, I, sh I should say. <laughs> Just giving you a fair warning here. I try to follow the memes, even if it's uh, against my uh, better judgment sometimes. <laughs> Alright. Going up. Jesus, thing takes a long time to go up. <laughs> well, that's the green one. Oh. Okay, I admit I was very hasty there. <laughs> Still have yet to find the blue one, which is the biggest mystery. This is gonna squish me if I go under it. That's what I thought. Alright. Oh, it's rotating blocks. This reminds me of uh, Super Mario 64, actually. And they alternate. It's a pretty easy pattern. Well, that was quick. <laughs> Alright. Still looking for blue one. Oh! 
I just want some garlic first. Oh, they can dive through the metal floor? How I didn't mean to give you more of my coinage. <laughs> well, I gave him more of my coinage. Uh, how did I let go of my... I, I didn't touch a button. Was it because I accidentally slipped on the control stick there? I'm, no, I don't know. Ah, uh, whatever, let's go up again. There's a secondary path over to the right. Behind those fences there. You'll see when I get up there. You just go like this and voila. Now, wait, did I want to fall down there or is there a way to get... No, I didn't think so. Like, what is... Nothing... Oh! Oh my. Oh. <laughs> I need a thing to open the thing. Anything will do. There we go. And this is gonna be dizzying. <laughs> but am I looking for anything in particular? No, it looks like all the prizes are at the end there. Oh, ice blocks! Do not stand on the ice blocks! <laughs> Unless you have to, per se. Oh, I'm gonna have to get onto a corner, aren't I? Do these rotate in the same direction or... Oh, it, it goes back and forth. Okay, so I have to get on a corner that's moving to the platform. Good. I think that's it. I'm pretty sure that's it. I don't see anything else that's special, so let's get out of here. And avoid more fish. Delicious coins. Ugh. I don't need any more fish, so I'm just gonna move up here. I'm still wondering where that blue treasure chest is. I mean, this the treasure chests are usually near where the switches are. Oh, oh, it isn't actually. There it is. <laughs> it isn't this time, so I... Can I jump the gun again? So I guess the treasure chests can appear far later in the level than I thought. Okay. Good to know. So I guess I really don't have to worry too much about, like, over-scouring things per se. There's a garlic guy. Can't... You can't actually hit him through there. <laughs> I just thought I would try that for the fun of it, and it actually worked. How can you punch through a gate? That doesn't seem plausible. Wait, I'm gonna go down here first, rather than check the upper... Oh, jeez. I have to actually be up there. I shouldn't fall down. But actually, what is the switch there? So I should hit this. Oh, and that makes the treasure chest up there appear. But there's still one switch accounted for, I think. Yes. And I I hope that's I'll find the solution to that somewhere around here. Hmm. Definitely not under you. Oh, you're the only thing that I can use to get inside that gate, because I need an enemy to get in there and I can't bring one up here. Very clever game. So I have to defeat a rather tough enemy to get in here. Ooh, tiny blocks. Hmm. Oh, they're not moving or anything like that. Eh. Oh. Oh my. <laughs> oh. Oh, how how did I do that? <laughs> On my first try. Um. Well, I got all the hurt fragments, and it looks like I got all the red crystals as well. So I guess the treasure chests are the only things that remain here. Okay, so about that upper path there, should I like go back around or, or something now that I've hit a few switches? Because I don't remember hitting the switch that I needed to get there. Oh! Ah! Somehow I slipped off rather than jumped. I'm, I did press the jump button. I swear it. Hmm, come on. I have to be up here to get to that one. There we go. Now, let's see... Or was it on the other side of this? It wasn't. But I still didn't hit the switch anyway, so it doesn't really matter now, does it? Hmm. I was gonna do one of these things to try and... Oh, I want to grab onto one of those sticky balls from that side. Guess you can't cheat the game. <laughs> that would be pretty awesome if I could do that, though. I think it's just a little bit too far to do it. Uh, I should actually kill you off, shouldn't I? 
Because you're going to be shooting at me as I'm going on top of those gears. You're probably going to knock me off into the lower area then if I don't. Why is there a little fence just for that area there? Is that like to prevent you from getting squished? That oh, it's to guide you onto the balls. Okay, now it makes sense. Now, if I were to ride these gears all the way up to the top, is there anything up there? Uh oh, there just might be. Uh, or is this the same upper path that led to... Yeah, this is the same upper path. Never mind about that. But it does look like the game kind of discourages you from going down there, even though you kind of have to go down there to 100%. Oh! There's the purple switch. So now I have to go back. And I have to go on the other side, which is here, I think. Yes. All right, and the last treasure chest is right up on the other ledge on the right side. Wow. <laughs> I am really, really impatient today, apparently. We've been through this path before. Nothing really more to commentate about. Oh, I can see the sticky ball that I need to jump on. I was unsure where I was supposed to go there, though. Whoa! Oh, there. Oh, I forgot there was one more sprite in me, I guess. Brawl Doll is the name of the boss. That, that's what I'm presuming, just by that. Oh, whoa, 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 what am I supposed to do here? <laughs> am I supposed to go down that ladder? Uh, looks like it. I'm just gonna jump down. <laughs> Whoa! Those things zap quickly compared to the other ones. And that's the last treasure. And that also means the game is... Wait, what's what's this? What, what do I need to come up here for? I sense a bonus. Uh, come on now. It's not that hard to grab onto chains. <laughs> e. Go around. There we go. What is... Oh, it's, it's just for the garlic guy, really? Well, I might as well, as long as I'm here. It's cheaper getting garlic than uh, continuing, you know, if you should die on the boss or something. I probably won't die on the boss, though. Then again, I somehow managed to die on regular enemies. <laughs> Alright. Let's do it to it! This part's going on for a long time. <laughs> I'm looking at the camera and it's like 30, gonna be like 31 minutes in the part right now. Maybe I shouldn't have done a uh, another level plus the boss. Well, maybe. Because that boss is only like 5 minutes, so... Well, this is creepy. This is nightmare fuel to be sure. Can I pick up... Wow! You can pick up these. Alright, so I'm going to... Do this. And then do this. Delightful. Now, what's your gonna? What's your retaliation here? You're gonna be shooting. Uh, wow, that's really, really easy to dodge. <laughs> that, however, I just ran myself right into. It. <laughs> that would also have been pretty easy to dodge. I just have to run away from him like that. And stun him. Ow. I'm gonna save those torches for the last two hits. I could probably also throw them off the edge to give them a hit. Oh, what is it? Oh, crisscrossing. Okay, so that's a little bit more difficult to dodge, I can see. He seems a lot more vulnerable to those torches being swung at him than just regular punches at him in the air. So it's probably a good idea to save those torches for the last couple of hits. Alright, what you gonna do this time? Mm, pretty predictable. Alright! Swing, swing! Oh, I lost my torch! That's one thing I never thought I would be able to say. <laughs> Wait, come to think of it, if I run out of torches, will this place be pitch black? Whoa! Whoa, whoa! Okay, so I still managed to dodge it pretty well. Now, let's just test it for the heck of it. Let's see how dark this place gets. Not dark enough to make it unplayable. And that's the end of the stage. As well as the part, of course. Woo! Yeah! Well, 
I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part. Well, I might as well show this again. Ah, shiny, beautiful, extra life. Well, it's not so much an extra life as it is having more health. Yeah, sure, I'll save. Again, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you.